Nathan Kultanoa is a highly talented player. He's someone that's probably been a little bit forgotten about in Australian cricket because he's been injured for so much. Um, didn't see him at all last year domestically, but the season before that we see him in the Australian One Day team and T20 team. He's on the fringe of playing some test cricket as well. So, um, look, anyone that can bowl above 140 k's an hour and swing the ball in India, um, you're, going to, you're going to make an impact. You can mention him in the same sort of breath as Pattinson and those guys, it's James Pattinson. When they're fit, you know, they, they, and, they're, and they're all together for the start of this summer, there's going to be some really, really interesting decisions made by, by the Australian selectors and, and Kurt and I's man will be up there. But am I surprised at what he's done in the, in the IPL? No, not really. Uh, I've seen enough of him to know that he's got all the tools to be a very good, very, very good international player. This is the last ball of the over. See, he's going, no, please, not again. Some, something's not right. The last four or five years, he just hasn't had a good run at it. You know, he's, he'll play six or five or six games in a row and then have a really bad injury. It's not like his injuries have just been one or two weak ones either. They've been, you know, a side that's been three months or a bad hamstring that's been uh, a few months as well and generally ruled him out of, of tournaments and, like I said, ruled him out of the whole last Australian summer. So, and I think everyone's seen that there's enough talent there for him to, to certainly play a bit more cricket for Australia in the future. In the air, that's me out, mid off, got him. Good, the has got the false shot. We're going to need to see a, shield, a full shield season out of him really before we start making those judgments because it's going to be really hard to, to trust someone like that in a test match if, they, you know, if, they, if they're struggling to get through um, good chunks of domestic cricket. But, you know, you think of Stark, Hazelwood, um, Cummins, Pattinson, you've got Coulton Isle, Jackson Bird, these sort of guys. You know, he's right in the mix with, with all those guys. Maybe not in the first, the first uh, picked 11, but he wouldn't be far away. It's gone! Marsh takes another catch. Brilliant, brave captaincy rewarded again for the Scorchers. When you've got match-winning players like that that are injured all the time, it's, it's frustrating for you as a captain, but you've got to think of how frustrating it is for the player. So that's the way that I used to look at it. Think about what the player's going through. Be positive as you can around them. You know, just let them know that go away, take your time, get fit and strong, and then come back into this team again when, when you're ready. But, um, yeah, so I think the support side of things is the biggest thing. And look at Coulton Isle here. Is this game mean anything to these players? There's your answer.